Um, I like to use the protein pancakes because it makes me feel like I'm getting in my protein for the day. Um, even though it's only like 12 grams of protein. Proteins? Hmm. Anyways, so today I do have a lot of homework that I don't want to do. It's my last class. So it's going to be extremely hard to stay with it. Um, but whatever. Um, but today I want to go test out some thrift stores. I want to go get some coffee um, and just kind of see where the day takes me. That's the thing about not working right now is that I feel like I have a lot of free time in my hands that I kind of have to fill, which is one of the reasons why I started doing this. Um, and I think that finding stuff to fill your day is important because if not, I'm just going to end up laying in bed all day, which I guess could be okay, but I don't want to do that. So, okay. So I'm going to go ahead and heat up my pan. I like to use this griddle thing. Um, just because I feel like it cooks my pancakes the best and without burning them. I'm really picky about my food. Um, breakfast is actually my favorite meal of the day, but I really hate making it just because I hate cooking. Um, if I could literally just throw everything in the microwave and it'd be done and like that, I would do that. But then I'd be eating like crap all the time, um, which I feel like I do most of the time, but whatever. So these pancakes are pretty much the only thing that I actually cook for breakfast. Um, I was cooking like egg whites a lot, um, but then after I got COVID, I absolutely hate the taste of eggs. So obviously for reasons just stated, I don't do that anymore. Um, so these are really like my go-to healthy breakfast, so to say. Um, I don't really think I have anything else that I enjoy making. Um, probably because these are just really fast and really easy. I literally throw in some powder, milk, an egg, stir it, and cook it up. And that's pretty much it. Um, I just think they're extremely easy to make, so. And I'm all about that easy life. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> My closet is full of literally like all black um i feel like i need more tops just because i i don't know i feel like i wear the same thing all the time um pants are fine i have so many pairs of jeans so many pairs of pants um shorts would be cool it's fine i feel like california is just so back and forth with their weather like literally one day can be 80 degrees going to the pool going to the beach and the next day it'll be raining. Like, it's just, I can't make up his mind. And so I think I need to find uh, some clothes that could go for both weathers. I don't think I can talk. Like, I really think maybe, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. 
You know, I'm really digging this whole YouTube thing. You know, I think that it's a really great way to kind of just express your thoughts and like just talk. Like it's all it's almost like journaling, but verbally and digitally. So I think it's really cool um to just kind of talk about whatever, you know, do whatever, be whoever, whatever. Um and just really express, you know, how how I'm feeling in the moment. So I'm actually pulling in right now to get coffee. I think I'm addicted. Coffee Addiction Anonymous. This bitch is uh, addicted to coffee. She needs help. So I got my coffee. This is like my go-to spot. If you're watching this and you're not from Ventura, if you are ever in Ventura, go to Simone's. I said this in my first video because I'm telling you guys, this is the best coffee shop. You know what? That just gave me an idea. I think I'm going to do a video where I try all the coffee shops, like family owned coffee shops in Ventura. And you know what? I'll include Ventura County because I think Ventura it you know i don't know i don't really i actually don't know what coffee shops are in ventura like i would have to really look i know that there's one downtown called like don't get mad at me because i don't know it's called like sun something or rather um that one is what i know there's there's another one downtown called Palmer. I don't know. I have no idea. No idea. That's something I'd have to look up. But that's actually a really good idea, and I think that'd be great. And that way, you guys can take my advice from the coffee that I try and go try. But I will say, <clears throat> when I'm trying new coffee shops, I typically get the same thing. So, like, you know what? We'll, we'll just go into that. That's a great video. That's stay tuned, ladies and gents, for a coffee. A coffee off you know a car I want is a Tesla that is a car that if I ever ever like become rich or even just make a li like a living like a good amount for a living that's the car I'm gonna get and if I ever have a, if I if I ever have the opportunity I will go ahead and buy it cash and if we're gonna get real cray cray and I like make a lot of money Make it pink i'm gonna make my tesla pink i am going to customize it to be like a hot no 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 no, like a baby pink and then i'm gonna have the inside be like all leather black with like a baby pink like trim how cute with like a pink steering wheel that's the goal in life that is like the ultimate goal in life you know like people say like oh goals to buy a house goals to have kids goals to do you know all this stuff no for me my goal in life is to buy a pink tesla and customize it and customize the inside to being pink 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 all right so as you guys can tell i've had my coffee and so it's time to roll out because your girl's getting a little too hyper so we gotta we gotta go somewhere you know what maybe i'll go grocery shopping me that's what we'll do we will go grocery shopping see i'm always just in the moment i like to go and do whatever i want during my days and i don't like i just like to like improv that's the word i'm looking for improv let's go grocery shopping guys <laughs> I keep coming back to Whole Foods that shit's fucking expensive and I like think that anytime I go back like it's gonna be cheaper but it ends up being like the same if fucking not more so I literally spent like a hundred dollars on like some meat and at first I was like okay I'm old because I usually only get like my meat from there I don't really get like full like grocery shopping from there just because it's so fucking expensive 
um but the quality of the meat is so good so i usually just get that but i got it and i was like okay like you know the uh two pounds of chicken was like 12 dollars a tri-tip was like 25 which is pricey but it's good um so I was like, okay you know i'm gonna add like you know a little couple things just to try it be like be that bitch the bougie bitch that shops at whole foods no i am not her i am not fucking her i i don't shop i shouldn't why do i shop at whole foods it's so fucking expensive i ain't got money for that but i got chocolate and milk probably the best purchase out of all the things i got today because the chocolate was on the bottom on the shelf and it just it just looks so fucking good i had to try it so i got this so hopefully it's good we'll see but I need to stop pretending like I'm that bitch because I'm not that bitch. I'm a fucking broke bitch is what I am. So, someone, please, like, knock some sense into me. You are not that bitch, Christina. You are not fucking bougie. You are not made of money. You are made of freaking, I don't know, brokenness. That's what. But, on the bright side, at least I got some good meat. So, we'll see. Okay, now for the ultimate taste test of the chocolate milk. no fucking way this is why i keep napkins in my oh my god and i'm driving it's all my hair okay so apparently i don't know how to drink um beverages but let's try this again i fucking spilled all over me so i didn't even get to taste it so take two you're not that bitch stop fucking acting like you're that bitch um yeah i don't think that i'll ever get this again um all i did to me was stay in my clothes and break my bank account so probably not gonna get it again all right so let's see what i got from whole foods for a hundred fucking dollars so first up we got yellow baby potatoes because i thought that four dollars was cheap but apparently now it's a fucking hundred Next, we got some pasta. Also trying to be that bougie bitch, but shit was like seven bucks. I'm never going to do it again. Um, and then I was like, you know what? Let's make some pasta, like some good pasta. So I got some ground beef to go with it. <laughs> also like $7, never going to fucking happen again. And then I was like, oh, cute little burritos. No. And then fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. And then I got some sauce to match my cute little pasta I was gonna make. <laughs> some asparagus for my chicken, my receipt, my chicken. And then I got some tri-tip because tri-tip is fucking bomb and Mark requested it so I had to get it. Um, and then I just got some straw of the berries. Um, and then some cheese. Honestly, I don't know why because I didn't need this, but cheese is fucking good. So here we are. All right, well, thank you so much for watching and thank you for tuning in on another vlog of whatever the fuck I do in a day. Um, stay tuned for the next video and can't wait to see you guys next time. Bye.